Hello, my name is Kira. I'm your virtual forestry advisor. I work for Chagask and my job is to provide Irish landowners with objective and independent information and advice. Today I want to give you a couple of facts and figures about the forestry sector in Ireland. At present, Ireland has just over 770,000 hectares of forests, or 11% of the land area. Ireland hopes to increase this to 18% over the next few decades. This means that we have one of the lowest forest covers in Europe. For instance, forests cover as much as 33% of Germany, and 74% in Sweden. That brings the EU average to well over 40%. Wow! About half of all forests you see around you here in Ireland, are privately owned by 23,000 owners. Most of those are farmers. The other half is owned by the Irish state. You may also be wondering about the split between conifers and broadleaves. Well, just over 70% of all trees are conifers, while almost 30% are broadleaves. This percentage of broadleaves is growing. Forests and wood are an important tool in the fight against climate change, because one ton of wood stores about one ton of carbon. Carbon is sequestered fastest by young trees growing vigorously, but far more carbon is locked up in older trees. Our forests have already locked up and store more than 300 million tons of carbon, and will continue to remove millions of tons of CO2 towards our national removals targets between now and 2030. Trees are a powerful tool against climate change. That is a lot of information, but wait there's more. Look around you. Wood has many essential roles to play in our daily lives. Nearly three quarters of all Irish forests are less than 30 years of age. As a result, the timber harvest from Ireland's commercial forests is set to double in the next 15 years. Most of this increase will come from privately owned forests. Ireland has eight large and many small to medium-sized sawmills, three large board mills, 16 large timber frame firms, and many, many other furniture and joinery firms. This allows us to export 430 million euros worth of forest products every year. Activities such as forest nursery operations, forest establishment, management, and wood utilization provide important employment opportunities, mainly in rural areas supporting about 12,000 jobs. This is expected to rise as the forests mature to 20,000 over the coming years. So, in summary, this means that forests play many important roles for us in Ireland providing multiple economic, ecological, and social benefits. Bye for now, until the next time.